Greetings. I want to tell you about some of the exciting things we're going to do in 2010 for our Year 10 students. In the past, the college has offered ICT as a, an option for students, and we've had up to 60 students choosing to do that. We understand that ICT is important, but we also know that in itself, it's not a subject so much as it's a means to understand and interact with our world. We've come to the conclusion that to learn ICT is best learned in the context of a lesson or another subject. For instance, to learn mathematics and learn to do a spreadsheet which will help support your data in mathematics. Or in uh, English, to use their word processing, email and maybe podcasts as a way of sharing information. So we're going to disestablish the Year 10 ICT classes and use that time to encourage teachers to build the ICT component into the courses the students are doing and teaching it in a context that they will understand and hopefully remember more. So what are we going to do with the periods that are made free or the options that are made free? Part of the government's agenda for 2010 onwards has been to get students to engage and be more physically active and fit. And so we've taken the same two periods, uh, or two option lines I should say, and made a one a girls option and a boys option in sport. These two options are designed to track and promote students into playing and participating in Saturday sport. There'll be 50 places at a maximum for the two classes. They will run all year and they will have between three and four periods per week depending on the week in the timetable that they sit. In the boys option, the boys will have cricket, rugby, basketball and football. In the girls option, they will focus on netball, basketball, football and, and I can't think of the last one, hockey. It's expected that a lot of students will want to do these two courses and there will be some selective process around those students who are taking part in Saturday sport and who are helping to, re to refine and improve their skill base. We believe that doing this kind of program at school will support the coaches who take them at the weekends and who try to build a, a skill-based team culture. It's our view that kids who are active and participating physically at this time of their lives are more likely to be able to take responsibility for their learning in other parts of the school. If you think you have a comment you want to make about this new idea or this initiative, feel free to email me at school. My contact details are on our webpage at www.kavanagh.school.nz. I look forward to hearing from you.